Oh, so we have a couple of hair transplantations today. Uh, in fact, two beard and one moustache. All of both of these patients have already undergone uh, job procedures with us, uh, rhinoplasty with us. Now they want to have a nice uh, shape of beard. And one guy also wants a dense moustache. So that's what we're going to do for today. So this is how he came to us first. So he's a model already from the South Indian city of Chennai. So he has obviously met and consulted many surgeons in that city and also in other cities. So we decided to get his chin forward, a little bit more anglization, a minimal touch on the nose as well. That's how he looks now. Uh, September, October, November. That's like just three months? Three months. Exactly. That's cool. So that's like pretty quick recovery for him because he has no issues, he says, right? Yeah. Absolutely no fine. Pain, nothing. nothing. He just feels like, like as if nothing was being done for him. <clears throat> and we also did a big genioplasty for you, if you remember. So that's him now. His now concern is he wants a malar uh, improvement in his projection of the cheek or malar bone augmentation plus beard. So I told him it's not a good idea to get both done at the same time, you know, because of vascularity. I tend to do the malar also from inside the mouth to avoid a scar. And this is also going to be in the same region. So we're going to start with a beard transplant for him first up. And few months later, if he's still desirous, then we will do your malar augmentation. <laughs> All right. So the plan for today is, uh, you can just show us a little bit. We're just going to do this much. Look straight. Yeah. So if you look at him, he has nice density here. It's just this area where we're going to concentrate today for the beard transplant and also from uh, this angle. So that's the plan and probably going to take us three hours, I think, because beard transplants have to be done very finely. Uh, we have a team that will take care of this, but still it takes a little bit longer than hair transplantation, especially in the head. And also we are able to have only one person do it in one time because we have to change sides and also give injections to make sure it's all numb. So the only requirement for this is you don't move. The earliest surgery you were sleeping. <laughs> I now you're going to, yeah, now you're going to be knowing things in a sense. You're going to be in the OR. Uh, we're going to be around you. And uh, of course, we're going to give you some lines. There, so, so you're comfortable. No yeah, you shouldn't move also because when you move, you know, we can just alter. First step is to take your hair I'm from the back. No, you have long hair, so we just take a strip. Nothing will be visible. Then we'll make sure. Yeah, yeah. No one will know. But here there will be little small, like blisters types. You know, like small dots. Uh, that will go only after about two weeks. two weeks. So we'll tell you what to do for the next few days so that you take care so that you know that happens. So nice to have you back, and <laughs> I hope you're going to be uh, once more satisfied after this procedure. And then we'll see you again after a few more months. Sure. Yeah? Thanks, man. Okay, I'll take one photo in your camera. 
I sweated and the hair will be careful. Um, after about 10th or 9th day, you take a proper shower. Do wash your hair down or the body wash. Do not take bath in hot water or cold is better or room temperature. Don't take hot water but it will kill the follicles. That's it. Spray only thing. First practice is medicines, antibiotics, painkiller. Don't apply anything here except saline. Any doubt, send photo to the WhatsApp number to be there to apply it. Okay, nothing will be there, but I'm just telling you. And don't sleep on the sides. If you sleep on the sides, you just bruise the graph in the first few days and it will be disaster. You have to sleep straight. No, it will be good to bring it up. On the head pack, it will be good to We give you some packs, we keep it on the back, on the pillow, when you're traveling. Sleeping on the sides, not enough for two weeks. I think it's good. If you want that thing to really take up, and that will shrink soon. Tomorrow, the after is short. That's because of the local mm -hmm. uh, So we'll wait for uh, like uh, three months at least and then you should be fixed based on all the growth and then Okay. Maybe on three Depending on this one, you can Not like that. I don't want to do many things that quickly quickly, right? You want to go from inside and that supply is the same. So that's why I told him this also do last. I don't want to do here again when there is something so much. Just be safe, that's all. No point spending one hour here and only half the graphs are growing. That you concentrate that here. This is really not a good area. So we said, I said last. We said, yeah, I know, we don't, it's not good.